what I realized, I look back over my life, so many things have happened to me. So many p people just hurt me so bad, you know, and I just know that God is unchanging and God never leaves. I'm a witness when people have treated me so cold and just hurt me so bad. You know, I can talk about it now, but I, my tears are tears of just how good God is and how good he's been to me when people have turned their backs on me, when they used me and abused me. I mean, they used me up and they went on their way. They were able to pick up and just move on like it was nothing, but God reached his hand down. And I'm telling you, when I didn't even want to be here in life, I wanted to just call it quits and say, I'm out of here. I can't take it no more. I want you to know that God was with me all the way. I'm a living witness. If you are going through something and you are down in despair, I mean, when people have walked off and left you, relationships, love relationships, deep, deep love relationships where you've given your all more, you've given, given more to that person than you've given to God. I can also relate to that. And even though it's a backward situation, because we're never supposed to give a person more than we give to God, our love. But I'm telling you, when people have walked off and left your heart on the floor, and you are crying out, I've been there. I'm telling you that God will pick your heart up and put it right back in your chest. When you feel like your heart is about to stop, God will pick your heart up and put it right back inside of your chest. He will mend those broken pain, those broken, those, those wounds. He will heal those wounds. Those pains, they feel like labor pains. I'm not sure if everybody felt labor pains, but I'm telling you, I've been through life where pain has felt like I was in labor. But God is telling you now to push. I didn't want to go forward, but God said, push, push. And when I begin to push, I push that pain straight up out of me. And that pain became a book. That pain became a ministry. That pain became a healing, healing to others. I'm telling you now that you won't be in that spot for long. You won't be in that spot permanently. It was just a season. Yes, they hurt you. Yes, they walked on you. Yes, they manipulated you. Yes, they treated you wrong. But I'm going to tell you something. God will never, ever, ever abandon you. He will never hurt you. He will never mistreat you. He will show you how to love people past those pains. Even though you went through and you want to draw up and you want to say, I'm never, ever talking to nobody no more. I'll never love anybody anymore. I'll never give my heart to anybody anymore. I'm telling you that God will change all things. He will change you. You will love again. You will live again. You will survive again. With God in your life, you will make it. With God on your side, you will make it. God is with you always. I got tears streaming down my face because I remember going through so much pain. But God was with me the whole time. You have no idea what I've been through. And I have no idea what you've been through. But one thing I know for sure is that God will see you through it. He will never leave you. He won't leave you broken and just sit there and stare at you and let you cry it out. He will be right there to collect your tears. I'm telling you, when you've had your heart snatched out of your chest and you was dragging on the floor, I'm talking about the person dragging out the door and leaving you behind and left you and never tell you where they were going. They just left your life. And you're there to pick up the pieces. God will pick the pieces up for you. He will pick the pieces up for you. Glory be to God. God is there with you. I need you to hear me and believe that God is there with you. Right there in the midst of that trouble. Right there in the midst of when you feel like your heart is about to stop. God is there. And he will see you through. Continue to keep pushing forward. 
God is with you always. Be blessed.